Okay, so today we are going to read Luke 11 verse 28. But he said, that is Jesus, more than that, blessed are those who hear the word of God and keep it. How many of us hear the word of God? Probably everyone hears the word of God. We come on Sundays, we hear the devotional, we read our Bible. Good Christians. But how many of us actually keep the word? How many of us actually apply the word? Because there's a very big, very, very big difference in just hearing the word, applying the word, or just coming and singing and dancing and actually worshipping God. Because even the world can hear the word. Even the world can dance and sing. But we are not the world, are we? We are are the children of God. There has to be a difference. Because you can't call yourself a Christian if you just come to church and you hear the word and you sing the songs and you go back home and you forgot it all. Because you know something? Believing in God but not obeying him is exactly what the devil does. The devil knows scriptures by heart. The devil shudders at the name of Jesus but does the devil obey him? Yeah. And we are supposed to be children of God. So I hope you are obeying and also hearing the word of God. Because many of us, you know, we come here and we sing and we go back home and we see no change. And then we are like, oh, the church is not working. No blessings. Best. Are you reading the word? Are you not only reading? Reading is easy, but are you applying it? Because that is where your blessings come. That is where change occurs. So I want to encourage us as a church that let us not become lukewarm or let us not become fake. But let us be act not just hearers of the word but doers of the word and when you when you when you choose to keep the word no then you don't go around searching for here's my blessing here's my blessing you naturally get blessed because you're doing the, you're sowing the right seeds you're doing the right work everything will fall into place so blessed are those who hear the word and keep it do you want to be blessed i know i want to be blessed so i encourage us let us keep our eyes on jesus do the work that god wants you to do obey his voice Keep God first and you know the rest will just follow. Amen.